question. Please be seated. Président, veuillez vous asseoir. On the court is now back in session. Reprise de l'audience. We are now going to hear the statement of suffering and harm by another civil party. That is through TCCP 256. And court officer, could you invite the civil party into the courtroom? Veuillez faire entrer la partie civile dans le prétoire. Good afternoon, Madam Civil Party. What is your name? Bonjour, comment vous nommez-vous? Civil Party. My name is Um Vanna. Je m'appelle Um Vanna. President, thank you. Je vous remercie. Madam Um Vanna. And do you recall your date of birth? Vous souvenez-vous de votre date de naissance? Answer. Réponse. I was born in October 1967. En octobre 1967. Question: Where is Question. your current address? Quelle est votre adresse actuelle? Answer: Réponse. I live in Thnong Relung Village, Liebo Commune, Tramco District, Takao Province. Question: What is your Question. current occupation? Quelle est votre Profession. Answer: I am a rice farmer. Je cultive du riz. Question: Can you tell the chamber the names of your father and mother? Question: Pourriez-vous nous donner les noms de votre père et Answer, de votre mère? Answer: My father is um Cha and my mother is um Non Paet. Et ma mère s'appelle Non Paet. Question: What is your husband's name and how many children do you have? Answer: His name is Nieng Sopon, and we have four children together. President, thank you. Le président, je vous remercie, madame. And Madame Um Vanna, as a civil party in this case. The chamber Monsieur will Cassel, give you an opportunity to make a statement of suffering and harm inflicted upon you, namely physical, material, or mental injuries, which are as direct consequences of those crimes and which resulted in your civil party application. Des crimes commis et qui vont and this is in relation to the crimes which are alleged against the two accused Nun Chi and Kiel Samphorn, and which happened during the Democratic Cambodia period, that is from the 17 April 1975 to the 6 January 1979. And Madame Chai Parinet is a TPO staff uh, to Madame lend Chai her assistance Parinet to this civil party during her testimony on suffering and harm. And as requested by the Litco lawyers for a civil party, the floor will be given to the Litco lawyers first uh, to put questions to this civil party regarding harm and sufferings. The floor is yours. La partie civile, vous avez la parole. 
ส่งขอคุณหลุกเทียน Thank you, Mr. President, and good afternoon, Mr. President, and your honours. Madame et Messieurs les juges, bonjour. And good afternoon, Madame Um Banna. Madame Um Banna. My name is Hong Kum Soon, representing civil parties. Je représente les partis civils. I'm I'm also a lawyer in case zero zero two. Representing the civil parties in this case, you just stated about your current address, and can you also tell the chamber your place of birth? Dire à la chambre votre lieu de naissance. Answer. My place of birth is. The same that is in Thnong Rulung Village, Libo Commune, Tramco District, Takao Province. Question: Before the Democratic Committee period took control of the country, where did you live? Avant l'avènement du Kampuche démocratique, où habitiez-vous? Answer: I lived in Takao Province. J'habitais dans la province de Takao. Question: And can you tell a little bit more details? Was it at a provincial town or in a particular commune or village? President, Madame, Madame, please observe the microphone before you respond. Answer: I was living in the provincial town of Takai Province. Question: And when the Khmerus Enter the provincial town of Takao. Were you allowed to live at the same place, or were you moved elsewhere? Answer: When the Khmerus arrived, they chased us away from the provincial town, and we walked on foot to Chotil, a village. In Takao Province. Question: So you were moved to Chotil Village in Tramco District, and later on, were you moved elsewhere? Answer. The unit chief of Chotil Village moved us to Ong Norie Village in Libo Commune, Tramco District, Takao Province. Question. And can you recall when that happened? Vous souvenez-vous à quel moment cela a eu lieu? Demande l'avocat. Answer. It was in mid 1975. Question. Why didn't you and your family members return to your native village? Pourquoi n'êtes-vous pas revenu à votre village natal avec les membres de votre famille? Because we were forced to go there and cannot, we could not go to our native village. Question. And when you moved to Ong Norie Village, what were you assigned to do? Answer. When I arrived at Ong Norie Village, I was living together with my parents and siblings. And by 1976, I was separated and I was placed into a unit, a mobile unit for children at the Liebo Pagoda. Question: Can you provide a little bit details as to as whether you were placed into a mobile unit or a children mobile unit? L'unité au sein de laquelle vous avez été placé. S'agissait-il d'une unité pour enfants, d'une unité itinérante? The children mobile unit was not part of the cooperative. It was a separate unit, and there were actually two units. And for the mobile unit, children which age from eight would be put into the mobile unit. Question. And did 
you volunteer to join Vous that êtes mobile unit. volontaire pour faire partie de cette unité itinérante. Answer no. Réponse non. I did not volunteer. Non, we were forced. Volontaire. On nous a forcé. Uh, to join that unit On and we were not allowed to stay at home. Unité. On nous a pas autorisé à rester chez nous. Question. You said that day whom are you referring to when you were moved to the mobile the children unit? Lorsque l'on vous a demandé d'intégrer cette unité itinérante. Answer. People who Réponse. I was forced to uh, join their unit by Tawak. C'était Tawak. He was the unit chief. Question: Which village? Answer: It was Angnoria village. Question: De quel village s'agit-il? Réponse: Angnoria. Let me repeat: uh, The village chief of Angnoria. Name Tawak. Ta Question. Question. When that uh, village chief sent you to the children mobile unit, à where was enfants, that unit uh, based? If you can recall. Basée? Vous en souvenez -vous? Answer. Réponse. The children mobile unit. Unité Des enfants was uh, based at uh, District 105, Sector 13. That's all I can recall. Tout ce dont je me Question. Question. District 105 or Sector District 13? Do you know the actual name for this numerical representation or assignment for the district and sector? District, tant and que pour le secteur. it was for a Tramcock district. Cela faisait référence au district de Tramcock. Question. Question. What were you assigned to do when you were in the children mobile Et unit? Et que vous a-t-on demandé de faire lorsque vous étiez dans l'unité des enfants? Answer. Qui était une unité itinérante. We were assigned réponse. to carry us. Uh, on nous a for uh, the dam building together with to work there together with the uh, women's unit. Question. Question. Can you describe uh, a little bit about the location of where you, uh, you work in the building of that dam? Answer. I was assigned to carry earth uh, for de de la terre building a dam called Preithit, and it was in Leibo commune. Se dans la commune de Leibo. Question. Question. Can you tell the chamber a bit about uh, the working condition there? La chambre les conditions de travail là-bas? Were you assigned to any specific jobs or tasks? Answer. Réponse. We were assigned to carry earth starting from 6 o'clock in the morning until 11.30 at noon. And if we didn't complete the work plan, si then we would be deprived of food. The ten, ten, a group of ten children Un had to finish ten cubic meters. And sometimes we could cube. complete it, and Parfois some other times we could not. If pas. the earth is soft si for the whole day from noble, morning till late evening, we could complete the work for them. And if the earth was hard, then we could not, and then we would be deprived of gruel. Question. You said that uh, your group, the children, uh, had to work there, and the work quota for you was 10 cubic meters. Can you provide a bit more uh, details on this? Yes, I didn't get it. Answer. Réponse. A group of us comprised of ten children. Notre groupe comprenait dix enfants. Question. Question. 
And you stated that if you could not complete the work quota, you would not be given uh, uh, rice or gruel. But you actually given uh, like cooked rice or uh, gruel. Answer: uh, We were Réponse. given only a gruel. On ne nous que de la There was no cooked rice for Et us. Pas de riz cuit pour nous. Question: And uh, could you eat at your own fill? Question: Mangez-vous à satiété? Answer: No, the food was never Réponse. sufficient non, il avait because we à were given only a gruel, a, a letter of gruel each. Et peu de Question: And when you Question. could not eat your own fill, et what else? Vous ne what did you do? Did you try to find other food to eat? Essayez-vous alors de trouver Answer, de quoi yes, vous nourrir? I did. Réponse: Oui, c'est ce que j'ai fait. Sometimes we were so starving, we nous avions tellement seek permission faim to go to the nearby bushes to relieve ourselves, but in fact we went to pick soulager, some en fait, uh, tree leaves that is from Tnang tree, and we ate those leaves because we were so starving. Question. Question. Was, were you allowed to find additional food by your unit chief or supervisor? Votre chef d'unité ou votre superviseur vous autorisait à aller chercher if, ce complément? If they found out that we picked the three leaves, réponse, then we no. would be arrested si and uh, beaten. And actually, we did it uh, without battait. letting them Nous know. Le faisait en cachette. Question. So you said if. Question. You were caught, then you will be si uh, tortured. Were you ever caught? Vous a-t-on jamais attrapé? Answer: Yes. Réponse: Oui. I was bitten. I was tortured. At that time, torturé. I sought permission to go to visit uh, my parents. And in fact, we were allowed only once a month uh, to, ho to do home visit. But then, because I miss my parents a lot, I moi. ran Mais to visit them, and I was caught, and I was uh, bitten. Question. When you said you were tortured or mistreated, can you actually Question. describe uh, what happened? Pourriez-vous décrire exactement ce qu'il s'est passé? Answer. I was bitten uh, and I was uh, tortured because at night time they would go and count uh, our heads. And if they, if they couldn't find us, then we would be in trouble. But usually I would uh, go back at around 3 o'clock in the morning as the head counting was at 5. And one time I was caught when I returned and I was asked where I had been. And I told them I uh, went to visit my parents and they said, don't was uh, any time because Ils répondu, ne perds pas ton temps. my parents did not benefit from me visiting them and Parce then I would be in trouble if uh, I broke uh, or I violated the discipline again. Si and if someone uh, got caught, then that person would si be arrested and uh, beaten up. And that was the case that happened to me. I was caught and uh, beaten up under the order of the unit chief. Question, did you know who gave that authority uh, to the unit chief? Was it from the village chief or from the si minister chief? Answer, my unit chief was a female by the name of Saru. Question. So when you were Question. arrested and tied up, can you describe a little bit about uh, what happened next? Was you beaten with a whip or a club, for example? Avec une matraque, avec un fouet, par exemple? Answer. After they arrested me, they, they beat me up. 
And that happened uh, for the first time, and then for the second time, and for the third time, I became seriously ill. I had a very high temperature, it was a bad fever, it happened day and night, and I sought uh, the permission to rest, but I was not uh, allowed to rest. And I went to seek for some medicine, and I was not given any, except uh, just a powder from cassava. And then my mother gave me some boiled, uh, some boiled water from tree leaves. And then I was caught again by another person for not uh, working, but uh, drinking that uh, there is no herb. Then I was arrested, tied against a tree and beaten up. And I, at that time, there were twenty young children there. I was beaten up while I was seriously ill. J'ai été battu alors que j'ai été malade, gravement malade. And. They not only used their hands uh, to beat me up, they used bamboo clubs with the nails attached uh, to beat me up physically, and there are scars remained on my body. I was tied up to the tree until the morning, and when the morning came, I saw blood all over my body. I felt so pity for myself. When I was in this trouble, I wanted the comfort of my parents, de but they were nowhere near me. Je voulais avoir le confort de mes parents, mais ils n'étaient pas à mes côtés. I shouted, Alors, asking crié. for my parents, but nobody came to help me. Parents, Only those who actually mistreated me were there. Là, que ceux qui m'avaient maltraité. I kept thinking of my parents. Je n'arrêtais pas de penser à mes of parents. Of another person who looked after me when I was away from my parents. Je pensais également à une autre personne qui avait pris soin de moi alors que j'étais loin de mes parents. And about once a month, the that man came to me to give me a food that he could uh, obtain, that he could find. Me donner des aliments qu'il arrivait à obtenir, qu'il trouvait. And he consoled me, uh, me not to weep, and try to work uh, as hard as I could, so that Anka would not uh, take me away and kill. Question. Question. I also share the suffering that you just described. And do you know the name of the man who actually helped you and who gave you uh, that food? Answer. His name was Ahmad and he was suddenly killed by the Khmer Rouge clique. Question. Question. You said um, Maj, Vous avez dit s'appelait um, As you said, Maj. Um, Maj was your other brother. He was taken away and killed by the Khmer Rouge. How did you know that? Qui a été arrêté et emmené et exécuté par les Khmer Rouge. Comment le savez-vous? Comment l'avez-vous appris? Answer. When I uh, recovered from the illness, I, uh, I could go Lorsque and then I stole a piece of a cassava and then I at, at lunch time. I went to the place where he Je worked to look for him, and I couldn't see him at Je his uh, workplace, so I asked people around Je and I asked a villager there by the name of Sowan where my Sowan. brother was. Je lui ai then où était mon frère. the person told me La quietly that my brother was uh, requested uh, by the unit chief uh, to go away on a vehicle. And I asked where he was taken to, and the person said uh, he did not know, but uh, he was put on a vehicle taken to the west direction. Counsel. In your victim information form, 
that is document D22-86 and in English EIN is 0045-0336 and another document that is D22 slash 86A, and it only exists in the Khmer uh, language. I'd like to clarify a little bit about your uh, victim information form. You stated that your brother disappeared or was arrested because he was requested by the unit chief, as the chancellor told the court. And do you know the reason for his arrest? Answer. I asked that man, Sowan, and another man by the name of Tal, and I was... I asked them uh, what wrong doings did my uh, brother uh, make, and I was told that he was accused uh, one time that while he was uh, stressing the rice at night time, he uh, accidentally laid his hand on the hand of another woman, and he was charged that he committed a moral misconduct. Question. So in Question. your sup supplementary information form, that Donc, is document D22-86A, uh, on the second page, Deuxième you page, stated that your brother que votre frère was arrested as he was a former lunar soldier. Can you tell the chamber if there is any discrepancy in your statement? Answer. Initially, I did not know uh, that my brother was a former lunar soldier, début, and I only knew that he was accused of, of uh, committing moral misconduct. Only later on, my mother told me that that was not the reason for his arrest, and the real reason for his arrest was that he was a former lunar soldier. For that reason, I submitted a supplementary information form with this additional information. Question. So when you uh, fill in your victim information for with the assistance of the DCCAM, you told them that uh, the reason for your brother's arrest was because of allegation that he committed a moral misconduct. But later on, you learned from your mother that the real reason was because he was a former lunar soldier. Am I correct in uh, summing up this statement? Answer. Yes, my mother told me about that, that my brother had been monitored for quite some time, but they could not find any pretext to, to arrest him. So when they could find a pretext to arrest him, they accused him of uh, being that and then taking him away. Question. You also uh, stated in your application that uh, your brother Omar might be taken not to be detained at the Krang Tachan prison. Can you tell the chamber when did you learn about the Krang Tachan prison? Au sujet de l'existence de la prison de Krang Tachan. Answer. At that time, I did not know where Krang Tachan was. À l'époque, je ne savais pas où était Krang Tachan. And only later on, when people from Srok Lu, or from the upper part of Cambodia, told me that told me about the Krang Tachan prison, and then my brother was taken there. That's why I knew about it. A president interrupt. The civil party lawyer. You only have ten more minutes. And if the civil party he has questions to be put to the accused. You can instruct her to do so through the bench. So, Mark Kunchan, look. 
je vais continuer. Les gens qui I, ont connu le, la prison de Kranthacham et la manière dont the les gens ont été amenés in à cette prison, donc c'est grâce à cela que vous and avez fait une telle déduction. Oui, les gens m'ont dit cela. Yes, people told me this. Um, Comme uh, mon frère as, uh, a été emmené à l'ouest, donc uh, il n'y avait que la west, prison de Kantachan uh, là-bas. Donc, euh, pendant la, la saison des fêtes there, so religieuses, je, religious je ferais des offrandes aux bons de frappe par an. Je faisais des offrandes deux fois par an. Question, j'aimerais vous poser des questions concernant questions to you regarding, um, votre uh, expérience uh, sous le régime Khmer Rouge. Under the Khmer Rouge regime. Um, uh, votre chef d'unité vous, vous a demandé de uh, trouver de la bouse, uh, to ramasser find de la bouse de or vache up, uh, cow et de dung, uh, couper des ébattoirs uh, creusés de la terre. Uh, voilà, pits. donc, uh, que so, pourriez-vous nous raconter ce qui s'est passé what happened? En 1977, à la fin de 1977, j'ai été chargé de faire des patois, donc vivre bouquet de patois par jour aussi. Je n'arrivais pas à atteindre le quota, je serais privé de... I was told that ma ration alimentaire I would not be est pour fed. Le, de la bouse, il faut remplir And des sacs. Et en termes de cow dung, j'ai dû remplir 10 bags, de de Otherwise, um, aussi. Aussi. I would also not be fed. Et comme euh, je... And, um, voilà, c'est parce que j'ai euh, pu remplir le tâches, c'est parce que je suis allé voir des, I was able to do my des job because, uh, vieux, les vieux parents qui élevaient des vaches. Je suis allé voir mes vieux parents qui élevaient des vaches. Question. Uh, raise, uh, cattle. Question. Vous avez dit que you said, pendant uh, uh, l'accomplissement de ces tâches, when vous you were avez vous avez vu performing your duties, you saw militiamen take people away cette, uh, for execution. Scène. Can you uh, give us a few more details about that? Quand, uh, des when des I uh, went uh, to cut à côté de la pagode de Saïtep, pagoda, au village de Roca Knon, j'ai vu sept miliciens village, I saw seven des, euh, 15 prisonniers, 15 prisonniers nous étions un groupe, mais we were divisé group en deux, divided donc, into two. Euh, un groupe de dix, donc a nous avons, euh, nous nous sommes euh, so euh, répartis pour recueillir des fruits scattered en, to pick fruit. pas de retard. Et in Rattan, nous avons vu des miliciens um, emmener des, take, um, des gens, donc trois miliciens avec des bâtons et cinq avec des with clubs fusils, et ils étaient très petits, rifles. ces miliciens, ils ne, pouvaient, ils ne pouvaient même pas porter des fusils, et on était tellement peur à, à, rifles, à leur vue, on we s'est so caché dans des buissons, uh, euh, environ à 20 mètres de but d'exécution, je les ai vus frapper à la nuque des uh, euh, victimes, victims. Euh, et les victimes And pleuraient, the victims ont pleuré, were weeping et nous, and yelling. nous avions eu tellement And peur, we et, were so afraid. et j'ai même perdu ma conscience, I even, uh, et tout le monde uh, s'est se, tu uh, pour uh, éviter uh, d'être uh, uh, aperçu avoid par ces miliciens, j'ai vu du sang I saw partout dans la forêt. Blood being shed everywhere in the forest. Question, Question. J'aimerais passer Now à I would vos like souffrances to speak about, uh, your suffering. après le régime Khmer, After Rouge, the Khmer Rouge régime. Que euh, ressentez-vous après le régime Khmer Rouge? After Et having lived through the Khmer Rouge régime, what 
réponse oh, your impressions. Euh, des maladies je how is your health malade, answer i'm always ill je, i wasn't able to go to school je suis arrivé seulement au niveau 4 i euh, only reached fourth grade je suis euh, tout le temps malade since i'm always ill and since my parents vieux, were old je pas pu aller à i wasn't Question. able to go to school question en ce qui concerne vos proches with regard to euh, your loved ones inoubliable pour vous Who is whom can't you forget? Answer. Je pense à tout le monde. I tout think monde about everyone. Euh, everyone. Euh, I miss everyone. Mon frère, I lost my brother. Aîné, my euh, older brother. Volait tout le temps des choses. He would always uh, steal things euh, from me. Me rendait visite. He would come visit me. Que les much more often sœurs. than my other brothers and sisters. Question. Question. Êtes-vous un un peu soulagé. Are you a bit relieved um, chaque fois que vous pensez each time à you think about disparu, your loved ones who disappeared à fois cela vous fait souffrir. or each time you think about them you suffer even more? Réponse, Answer. Chaque fois que je pense à Each la time mort de I mes think frères et about the death of my brothers and sisters and about si the torture I, I, want, I underwent, it is as if all of this happened yesterday. Question, do you have any requests to make? Ou, uh, des questions à poser do you have any questions la, uh, accusés, to put to the accused? doit être fait But par l'intermédiaire du président. Do, you have to do it des through the president. À formuler. So do you have any questions or requests? Réponse Answer. monsieur le président, Mr. President, une requête uh, à, I have a request à vous soumettre. J'aimerais que justice soit rendue like et que les done. auteurs des, like de ces crimes soient crimes condamnés to be à une réclusion de perpétuité. To be for life. Et j'ai également une autre quête à que mon avocat which is Euh, fasse en sorte que les to make, réparations collectives et sure psychologiques soient euh, rendues. Are made. Euh, question, avez-vous d'autres question. questions à poser Réponse, non. Answer, no. euh, question, question, merci madame la partie civile euh, d'avoir party. déposé. Euh, merci monsieur le président. Thank you, Mr. President. I have no further questions. Monsieur le procureur national, vous avez la parole. National uh, co-prosecutor, you now have the floor. Monsieur le président, le président, mesdames et messieurs Mr. les president, juges. Mr. Uh, president, your honors, uh, says the national co-prosecutor. J'aimerais vous poser I uh, would like, uh, une to précision request a bit of clarification from you concernant regarding uh, le fait que vous avez vu des uh, sept miliciens qui ont mené 15 prisonniers pour les exécuter. J'aimerais savoir dans quelle like coopérative cooperative you were at when that happened. Réponse. Euh, J'étais dans l'unité mobile in the qui était située unit, à, which was au nord euh, de, to the north du chemin de fer of the railway, euh, dans le district in the de Rokaknon. Question, Rokaknon. Euh, ça veut dire Question. que vous avez été transféré du village de Norieille sur le village village de Rokaknon. De Rokaknon est village, est-ce que c'est vrai Réponse, Answer. oui. Yes, indeed. Euh, j'ai été euh, transféré du uh, village de Norieille Norie dans le village de Rokaknon uh, parce Roca que là-bas, il y avait beaucoup de there, there Vous a lot y êtes allé route, uh, à, à, la, à votre affi so affectation uh, de uh, chercher des épatoires ou vous étiez uh, uh, intégré dans votre unité mobile de uh, manière permanente into your mobile unit on a permanent basis. 
Réponse, Answer. oui, bah, je, je, je faisais partie yes, de l'unité mobile, mobile euh, j'étais un membre a de plein droit. Full euh, quelle est la distance Question, entre le village de Norie et le village de Orokaknong village Réponse, euh, il y avait environ 30 km. 30 km. Question. Question. S'agissant des rations alimentaires Regarding dont vous avez rations, euh, fait mention tout à l'heure, à savoir qu'il qu y avait que du, de la soude de riz, donc j'aimerais savoir que vous décri given, uh, décriviez un petit peu euh, l'aspect like de cette soude de riz. Je vais vous décrire en détail. Réponse. Answer. La soupe de riz the rice que je recevais quand j'étais dans l'unité, elle était très claire, was parfois il s'agit bouillie, really very, very parfois uh, il y avait and sometimes euh, de la soupe à base de nénuphar, there was also question, quand water euh, vous n'avez pas atteint le quota, question. So when you did not euh, reach the quota vous étiez privé de nourriture. Euh, je, donc j'aimerais savoir si correct? vous étiez so like complètement privé de nourriture ou euh, votre ration a été réduite. Uh, réponse. Answer. Non, en fait, j'ai well, le droit seulement à la ration du midi, donc I à la soupe de riz à midi et pas le soup, soir. Uh, at la soupe du soir. Uh, quand uh, nous étions privés When de nourriture, uh, j'allais, uh, nous allions uh, voler des patates uh, douces uh, uh, où les vieux hommes uh, travaillaient. En leur absence, in the fields si, uh, il n'y avait pas de feu pour uh, faire cuire ces patates, no on les mangeait crues. Potatoes, we would just eat them raw. Uh, question uh, concernant les Now, uh, conditions de travail, vous travaillez uh, depuis 6h30 jusqu'à 11h30. Uh, Est-ce que à l'époque vous travaillez and seulement le matin et pas l'après-midi Réponse. Answer. Euh, L'après-midi, je travaillais jusqu'à 5h30. Question. Question. Est-ce que vous deviez travailler Did you le soir aussi to work in the evening as well? Réponse. Answer. Oui, il m'est yes. arrivé de travailler le Sometimes. soir. Hein, donc, les enfants... Euh, the Children euh, devaient had to creuser des fosses pour cultiver des cocotiers. Pits, uh, to plant coconut trees. Question. Question. Euh, donc creuser des fosses so, pour cultiver des cocotiers euh, coconut représente trees. pour vous une tâche so, difficile ou une did you tâche that correcte an easy pour task les enfants de votre âge something that was acceptable for children of your age. Réponse. Answer. Oui, creuser des well, fosses pour cultiver les cocotiers n'était pas un travail facile non, parce qu'il uh, fallait faire because, ça uh, de cela de 6h30 jusqu'à 10h du soir de, et il fallait absolument accomplir cette tâche. Donc c'était un surmenage pour nous, mais il nous était impossible. On n'osait pas refuser de faire le travail. Question, vous avez fait effectuer ce travail pendant combien de temps Réponse. J'ai été chargé well, de creuser charge, uh, ces fosses uh, pen pits, uh, pendant presque un mois uh, entier. Enfin, one pour un mois, month. il y avait deux ou trois jours où on ne travaillait well, pas. We had two to three uh, days when we wouldn't work in a month. De, uh, And unité you're mobile, speaking about which mobile uh, unit? Uh, unit mobile qui était situé was dans quel village? In a mobile unit that was located in which village? Um, uh, réponse, answer. Uh, 
je parle de l'unité mobile about, uh, de, du village de Tire. Question. Tire uh, village. Question. Je parle du travail de nuit, euh, du soir I'm euh, que about the night vous avez effectué. That you had to do. Euh, et j'aimerais savoir And like to know euh, dans quelle, in quelle coopérative étiez-vous. Euh, C'est-à-dire de... Pendant tout le régime Khmer Rouge, that, vous deviez so faire must ce I understand that you had travail to du soir ou c'était seulement regime, pour or une période was this only for a certain period of time. Réponse. Answer. On m'a demandé de creuser des, des fosses pour cultiver des cocotiers dans le village de Chirey même. Shrem village. Question, Question, en dehors de cette coopérative de Chirey, uh, uh, avez-vous été forcé à travailler pendant uh, la nuit ou à effectuer du, uh, du travail du soir Réponse Answer. Oui, yes. euh, euh, j'ai été euh, transféré au village de Kna le Kna jour euh, euh, je devais couper des directoires, ramasser de, de la bouse et de, le soir, il fallait creuser des dung, pour cultiver and in the des Question, donc Question. en fait, euh, ce so, travail euh, this work, uh, était was, euh, um, à durée euh, Or would last, um, he did this, this work for the entire Khmer Rouge. That means that during the entire Khmer Rouge, you had to work night and day. Is that the case? Oui, yes, je I had to work nuit. night and day. Question. Question. Dans l'unité dont In vous avez fait mention tout à l'heure, hein, quand vous travaillez dans cette unité, vous avez été à, atta unit, arrêté, attaché et frappé par les enfants de la même unité. J'aimerais savoir pourquoi ils ont frappé. Réponse, euh, ils avaient le droit de me frapper well, parce que le chef de l'unité leur a donné ordre de me frapper. Euh, question. question. Euh, vous voulez dire que so les autres enfants de votre unité unit, uh, devaient vous frapper uh, 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 sur ordre de, du chef de l'unité uh, Réponse, Answer. dans l'unité, il y avait 100 unit, enfants, mais il y avait seulement 100 children, 20, une vingtaine d'enfants qui m'ont frappé. Question. Question. Pourquoi Why vous, a, vous avez été puni puni de, de la sorte in that way? Réponse. Answer. Parce que j'ai demandé l'autorisation de rendre visite à ma mère qui était malade et j'ai um, fui, enfin je fled, suis allé I, chez moi en cachette. I went home, uh, question. question. Et uh, uh, receviez-vous souvent uh, de telles tortures sous le uh, régime démocratique during the Democratic Kampuchea regime? Réponse. Answer. Oui, yes. c'était assez fréquent. This happened quite mais, often. Les autres enfants, d'autres enfants, or ont other children subi de telles also tortures aussi, mais à in degrés différents. But to, to a different extent. Question. Question. Les 20 euh, enfants or so qui ont été désignés pour euh, vous battre hein, euh, étaient-ils de quelle catégorie et Which category les enfants did they qui subissaient to? ces actes de torture And the who étaient were tortured, de quelle catégorie Which category did they belong to? Euh, réponse, Answer. les enfants du peuple the de base avaient le droit de battre les enfants du peuple du 17 avril. 
question. Euh, cela veut dire que so les, means that, uh, les autres uh, enfants other qui subissaient de telles uh, tortures uh, étaient tous way, des enfants du peuple nouveau. New people, children. Uh, est-ce exact? Is that the case? Uh, réponse. Answer. Oui. Yes. Euh, ceux qui subissaient de, des actes de torture étaient tous des enfants du peuple nouveau. New people, euh, au document D22-86, en Vous avez dit que de, une dizaine d'autres enfants subissaient les mêmes actes de torture à cause de, de la vengeance. Est-ce qu'il y avait d'autres raisons Were there other reasons et quelles étaient les formes de vengeance Look, with me, Mr. Kopé. Um, thank you, Mr. President. Mr. Kopé. We've Merci, been Monsieur hearing Président. now for almost 55 minutes very detailed evidence. Cela fait déjà 55 minutes uh, I'm que looking nous at the clock. I know there's one civil party still détaillé. on the schedule. Nous Are we now nous supposed to um, ask questions in the next 10 minutes to be able to counter a little bit of, or a piece of this evidence? Um, uh, uh, this civil party testified to so many uh, different things. There's no way we can uh, do this in, in the next 10 or 15 minutes if uh, the prosecution would still continue. So I'm, I'm, I'm at a loss here. You've been uh, instructing, I think, for seven times now, uh, civil party lawyers and the prosecution to focus only on uh, suffering and impact, but we've been hearing uh, almost always detailed evidence. And uh, if you only will allow us now 10 or, 10 or 15 minutes, we might as well not answer, uh, ask any questions. So, um, I think, again, this is not the appropriate way of proceeding uh, in this matter. Monsieur le Président, en fait, c'était ma dernière Sorry, question. Sorry, this will fait. be my last question, in fact. Uh, Allez-y. Uh, please proceed. Uh, je vous rappelle ma question. Uh, let me ma... remind you of my question. Est-ce que... Uh, which is... Um, Qu'est-ce que vous entendez par what do you haine et mean vengeance? What by hatred and vengeance? Réponse. Answer. Les enfants du peuple the de base base qui people, nous haïssaient parce que nous sommes arrivés là-bas seulement vers 73-74 nous étions des enfants, des soldats ou des officiers and we were children of soldiers euh, des and officers, mères uh, et quand... Uh, or officials, and, uh, non, en fait, nous sommes well, arrivés fact, seulement en, uh, 60, en 1975 in et donc nous, fact, nous étions du peuple nouveau and we were new people, et ils nous détestaient, and they hated us. Uh, ils, nous, ils cherchaient they tout le temps la petite bête looking for the small fault, pour uh, nous uh, in order uh, frapper. To, uh, beat us, uh, le procureur, je, je n'ai plus de questions, no le Président. Uh, L'avocat de Nuantia, vous avez Nuntia, la parole. Uh, defense, uh, counsel, you have the floor. Um, but the rounding up of questions by the Mr. prosecution Kupi. doesn't necessarily answer um, the, the questions that we asked. Do we now only have uh, five or, let's say, ten minutes? Question. How, how many minutes do we have? De combien de temps disposons-nous à présent? De dix minutes, quinze minutes? If you say we only have 10 minutes, I might as well sit down and don't si ask any dites, questions. Si vous me répondez que je ne dispose que de 10 minutes, eh bien autant que je me rasseille, que je ne pose aucune question. Counsel. 
Council. How long Là, would you friends. need if you ask Maître, all the questions you deem relevant, relevant temps, to this part of the trial? Si vous vous contentez de poser des questions pertinentes, pertinentes. Well, in, in, in theory, Maître not in theory, in practice, everything that this theory, witness has said pratique, testified to is relevant. Um, how much time do you need? I don't know, 45 minutes, de de same de time as, as the prosecution and civil parties together. That's even less, pas, by the way. And the Chris Ampang defense? L'accusation. Et quand est la juge fait Donc, qu'en est-il de la défense de Kiel Sampan J'ai well, très peu de questions, I have very Monsieur few le Président. To put, Mr. President. Um, la Chambre a décidé de donner, d'accorder 40 minutes à la défense des deux équipes de, de défense. Thank you, Mr. President. Good afternoon, uh, Madam Civil Président. Party. I have um, Bonjour, a number of questions to ask uh, to you. Questions. First, I would like to ask you some more details about your uh, unit chief. You said that her name was uh, Saru. What else Saru. can you tell us about her? No, it, it well, is in fact, her name was Sarun, not Sarun, Sarun, but Saru. I apologize for my pronunciation, uh, my pronunciation uh, but I meant uh, Saru. Je bien de Saru. Uh, can you tell us some more about uh, this unit chief? De ce chef Réponse. Answer. Mon chef de My Saru, unit chief Saru nous forçait à travailler obliged jour et us nuit. to work day and night. Um, my, my question was not my question was not uh, relating to what she made you do, but my question was as to who this person was. Can you give us some more details? Uh, her age, um, her full name, son âge, um, son nom complet. Was she a member of the Je Communist Party of Kampuchea? All, all those details. Ce genre de détails, ce genre d'information. Réponse. Answer. Je ne connais pas son nom complet. I do not know that person's full name. Elle était appelée Saru. Her et name was je ne Saru. connais pas son nom de famille. And I do not know her family name. How old was she? Maître Copé, quel âge avait-elle? I did not know how old she was. Approximately. I could say she was about 54 to 55 years old if uh, as of uh, now. If she is uh, still living. Si elle est encore vivante aujourd'hui, c'est l'âge qu'elle aurait. I'm not so good at math. Um, uh, would she be? Je ne suis pas très versée en mathématiques, mais. 
Donc elle avait entre 15 et 20 ans à l'époque Réponse. À ce moment-là, elle était elle devait avoir 15 ans à l'époque. Um, you, you know Savez-vous si elle avait des parents yes, she did. Oui. Do you know whether they were members of the CPK? Question. Savez-vous si elle était membre du PCK The mother of the unit chief Saru was a cook. Have you ever seen uh, Saru speak to other Khmer Rouge cadres or CPK cadres? Yes, I was concentrating on my work. I did not uh, see that. Je n'ai pas vu cela parce que moi j'étais concentré sur mon travail. Did you ever hear others Question. speak about uh, people giving her instructions what to do with her unit? Parler des instructions qui lui auraient été données sur la façon dont elle devait gérer son unité? No, I did not know about that. Réponse, non, je ne savais pas. When there was a, uh, an order, then the unit chief would be called ordre, through the meeting, and we, the alors, member, did not know anything about that. Réunion, nous, did you ever see other rien. Khmer Rouge cadres um, in the company of uh, Saru, en de Saru uh, when you were at work? Yes, there oui. was Saram, who was the uh, superior, the superior, superior of Saru. Sa superior hiérarchique direct. Saram, you said. Question. Saram, and, vous avez dit. And, and who was Saram? Et qui était Saram? Saram. Maître Copé, Saram. Saram. Saram was the direct superior of Saru, and this person was overall in charge of the children. And can you can you tell us some more about Sarai? Who was he? Sarai was the chief, uh, overall chief. chief. That's all I knew. Sarai was overall in charge of the 200 uh, children. Saru was in charge of 100 uh, children. And another person, Mom, was in charge of another 100 of the uh, children. And this um, Sarai and Saru um, Sarem were they always, Saru. were they, were they the unit chief and and and, and the people in charge um, through seventy five up until the end of seventy eight? Sont-ils restés responsables en charge donc jusqu'à la fin, c'est-à-dire de soixante quinze jusqu'à fin soixante dix huit? I Réponse. came to the unit in 1976 and I remained there with them until 1979 when the Vietnamese uh, arrived and we uh, separated from one another. Um, you were telling us earlier about an incident um, that you were beaten. Um, can, you, can you tell us a bit more about this, this incident? When exactly, or when, when approximately did this happen? Question. 
I was bitten hey, up boss. in late 1977. Um, was um, Saru together with Sarim Saru with, with a present uh, when this happened? Was Saru present when When I was being tortured, Saram in Réponse. fact ordered Saru. Saram a en fait donné un ordre à Saru. To find me and arrest me. And then Saru, Saru ordered the best people to arrest me. Demandé au peuple, au peuple de base de m'arrêter. So when you were beaten, it was both Saru and Saram who were present. Is that correct? Donc les deux étaient présents au moment où vous avez été battu. Est-ce exact? Sometimes uh, they were there and sometimes they were not and I was not beaten up only uh, for one time, it was uh, several times. And do you know whether Saraim um, was in contact with his superiors? Savez-vous si Saraim était en contact avec ses supérieurs? No, I did Réponse. not know about that. No, je n'en savais rien. Do you know if Saru or Saraim were ever Question. punished for si uh, mistreating you and others within the unit? Jamais été puni pour vous avoir maltraité vous et d'autres au sein de l'unité. Réponse. No, they were not. Non, ils n'ont pas été punis. How do you know? Question. Comment le savez-vous? Because I did not see them being tortured. Je n'ai pas vu qu'on les ait torturés. Did you always know where they were? Question. Et saviez-vous toujours à quel endroit ils se trouvaient? I knew Saru uh, was in Saima village. Réponse. Je and sais que Saru était dans le village de Saram was in Kna village. Saram était dans le village de Kna. Um, let me turn to another uh, topic, Madam Civil Maître Party. Je passe um, à présent à un autre sujet, Madame la Partie Civile. Your earlier testimony about your brother. Vous, vous um, I believe you said frère, earlier that uh, your mother had told you um, that your brother had been monitored for a while um, and that they just needed a pretext to have him arrested. Plus que Is that pour uh, an accurate summary of what you just said? Un bon de ce que vous venez de nous expliquer? Tiens. Réponse. Yes, that is correct. Oui, c'est exact. Um, did your mother ever tell you how she knew Question. Votre that mère your brother was monitored? Elle dit comment elle savait que votre frère faisait l'objet d'une surveillance. I did not know about that. Réponse. Because uh, she was Je ill, staying at home, Parce elle était and then uh, à la people came to the house and asked her about the what, uh, what kind of jobs that the children did. Et lui ont demandé quel type de travail faisaient ses um, enfants. Do you know whether it was known within Coppe, uh, the cooperative or, or the commune or the district? Savez-vous um, si au sein de la coopérative what the background ou dans la commune was of your ou dans le district? Le, la biographie ou le contexte de votre frère était connu de tous. Yes, they did. Réponse oui, ils sont passés. They knew that he was a Lonol soldier. Qu'il était soldat de Lonol, maître Copeau. Uh, and, and do you know um, when they knew that? Right from the beginning, right after 17 April 1975. Uh, 
I did not know uh, as to when. Um, let me let me ask it a different way. Did they know for quite a while already, before he was arrested, that he had been a long old soldier? déjà depuis longtemps avant qu'il ne soit arrêté que votre frère était soldat de l'Omnol? They knew about that and then they came to ask my mother but my mother did not tell them and they also asked the neighbors and at that time I did not know what they asked my mother and only later on when I made the application as a victim in as a civil party in this case, Lorsque I went to ask my mother about that, dossier, and then she uh, told me the reason for his arrest, that he was a former a soldier and not just because of the moral misconduct. Do you know um, whether he had any rank within the Lonnol army, your brother? Il occupait un quelconque rang particulier dans l'armée de Lonnol? No, I did not know the rank. Je ne connaissais pas son rang. Um, did you know what his activities were? What, what he had done in the Lonol army? Savez-vous quelles étaient ses activités, ce qu'il avait fait dans l'armée de Lonol? No, I did not. Non, réponse, je ne savais pas. Have you ever seen him before 1975 in a uniform? Avant 1975? Yes, I did. Réponse, oui. So there is no, uh, there's no doubt as to the fact that he was in uh, a, a soldier within the Lone Wolf Army. That Donc, is correct. Il était bel et bien Madame soldat Sobhupati. dans l'armée de Lone Wolf. C'est exact. Ça ne fait aucun doute. Yeah. Réponse. Yes. Oui. Um, did you know Question. if he told uh, the local authorities after 17 April 75 uh, in his biography that he had been a Lone Wolf soldier? Dans sa biographie, qu'il était auparavant soldat de Lone Wolf. No, he did not. Réponse non, il ne l'a pas dit. President, the deputy international co-prosecutor, you have the floor. Co-procureur international, vous avez la parole. Merci. La réponse a déjà été donnée, Monsieur le Président, mais je comprends que la défense a besoin de 45 minutes si c'est pour poser des questions qui invitent la partie civile à spéculer. Euh, sur des But choses qu'elle ne savait sans doute pas parce qu'elle avait du temps à l'époque. Je pense tout de même qu'il y, y a des limites à ne pas franchir, on a un temps limité, on a encore une autre partie civile. On a demandé à ce que les parties posent des questions pertinentes, nous nous sommes limités à 10 minutes de questions. Euh, nous espérons que la, la défense puisse faire de même et poser des questions utiles et pertinentes à la manifestation de la vérité. To the manifestation of the truth. Um, if I may respond, Mr. President, I think these are Monsieur quite relevant questions because I heard her say that her brother had been monitored for a while um, and that they needed the pretext to have him arrested. And this, this could indicate that um, the mere fact that her brother was a lone old soldier was not a reason uh, to be arrested, which goes directly to the question whether a policy um, existed in relation to lone old soldiers and officials. Um, so, um, des soldats and, de and reiterating the fact that it was the prosecution and the civil parties who had 45 minutes of requesting testimony, and you granting us already five, 45 minutes as well, that I think I'm entitled to uh, ans, ask these questions to the civil parties.
President, uh, the objection is overruled, and Council, you may uh, proceed. Um, I believe maybe you answered uh, the question already, Madam Civil Party, but you Madame said, I think, um, that he hadn't told in his biography that he had been a loyal soldier. Did I understand your answer correctly? Yeah. Yes. Was it subsequently later known whether he had served in the army? Was that known with the local authorities? Later on, they knew about it after they did the research, they asked uh, the cousins, and they asked the neighbors about that. I understand. And is it your testimony that your mother said that they nevertheless needed a pretext to have him arrested? Yes. And, and how did your mother know that simply having been a lone soldier was not enough to be arrested? She was not aware of that. But then I'm asking my earlier question, how did your mother know that he had been monitored for a while and that they only needed the pretext to have him arrested? She knew about it because she had some of her relatives who were the base people. Elle savait parce que certains des membres du peuple, certains des membres de sa famille étaient peuple um, de base. I'm looking at the clock, uh, Mr. President. It's time for a Monsieur break, or should I continue? Que c'est peut-être l'heure de la pause. Souhaitez-vous que je poursuive? President, it is now convenient to take a break. We take a break now and return at three o'clock. Court officer, please. Uh, assist the civil party during this uh, short break and invite her back into the court room together with the uh, TPO uh, staff. At uh, 3 o'clock, the court is now in recess.